All right, what's up, everybody? Deus Ex Dragon here, back for another episode of Let's Play Tales of Vesperia Definitive Edition. In the last one, we have made our way to the forest here of K Mok because Rita has a job for the Empire to do, quote, quote. And we also apparently acquired the old man that's been stalking us and tricked us, Raven. Um, I'm gonna have him replace Repeat for a bit because Raven is an interesting character, and you'll see in a minute. Um, unfortunately, the thing is that I don't have an outfit idea for him because, sadly, with the Definitive Edition, you got outfits and stuff, but the thing is, is that his outfits are kind of meh. I don't think they fit him. So his base one is honestly the best, for, in my opinion. But anyway, that's enough rambling. Let's go ahead and dive deeper into this forest. Uh, let's see if I can get that. Dang it. Sorry if I hurt you. Eh, yeah, since I haven't, I could have sworn I ran into these, but Billy Hell, I can't say that name right. Level 20, 2800, mm, not too special. A cornered cat becomes a lion, or so they say. I mean, yeah. Thank you, thank you! Oh, come on. You can't say that. Yeah, he's too funny. Uh, moving on. Oh, get away from me. But, oh, uh, since we're here in May, I'm hoping everybody's had a good time, and I put up that. I feel like an easy win. Let's just get it over with. Oh, power that defies my enemies! And I got ahead of myself. There we go. Grasshopper, such a common name. <laughs> um, stats aren't too special. Don't hit it with earth, hit it with fire. Just like any other thing. Such grace. Odin of this modest land. Holy power, First aid. So don't pick any more fights. Thank you, thank you. And he learned a new burst on and Carol leveled up. That is, the fire was so really interrupted. Yeah, hold up. Forgot poison does carry over. Uh, do I have one? No, that doesn't count. Shoot. Oh, yes, I do. Actually, I have 11 of them, and I'm sitting here looking like a genius. So do that. Yep, we've hit May, and I posted my little comment for the month, and I'm hoping everybody is doing well. Oh, don't mind me. Do whatever you came to do. What should we do about him? Do you know any tricks that'll convince us you're worth keeping around? Do I look like some kind of street magician to you? Come here a second. What? M me? Hmm. Huh? What do you want with Carol? No! Ah! Don't just leave me here! Show him what for, kid. D Should be any minute now. Ah! It exploded from the inside. What did you do? You just wait for them to let their guard down, give them a little poke, and then BAM! Geez, I bet you're great at parties. I suppose that was good enough. 
Really? Yes. All right. Hey, you mean I passed? I can stay? Uh, are you kidding? It'll be much easier to do things to him if we keep him nearby. Dang. I mean, accurate, but dang. What do you mean, things? Hadn't thought about that. Okay, just got a little chill up my spine. Well then, Mr. Raven, after you. <laughs> right. Well, Raven, I'd be fearing for your safety, but at least you have quote-unquote friends, right? Right? <laughs> oh, but yeah. Raven has a trick or two that's pretty nice. Uh, and another one. It's hard to read that. Don't tease the boy. What about Raven then? Okay, but he learned a new skill, Bug Breath. And we have a skit, Scary Things. Wow, Carol, when you freak out, you really freak out. Come on, everyone has a few things they're afraid of, don't they? Not me. Now, now, genius mage, it's not nice to lie. Even old Raven's got his own fears. What are you afraid of, old man? I'm afraid of pretty girls. What? Yeah, yeah. Rita, it's better to come clean. That way we can help you out. Like anyone needs your help. I can take care of myself just fine. Her type always has some of the worst fears. Yeah, whatever. <laughs> I mean, it's true, though. Those who say they're not afraid of nothing are usually afraid of something. And, ah. Nope. Come on. I want the chest. Okay, screw it. Right. an old man, so yeah. But anyway, we have a sword, the yes, stop. A solid sword designed to pierce through, not the armor. Wait, what? Designed to pierce 
through not the armor joints, but okay, my bad, I was reading that wrong. But the armor itself. Basically just a pointy sword. Um, we almost got what I need from him. What do I have when you get oh yeah, that's right, I want auto medicine. Um You know that's wrong. It gives a magic buff, but its magic attack sucks. Like, that is so wrong, but okay. And orange gel. Yeah, I don't think I can dodge that. Yeah. Hurry, I did it! And just into another one. Alright, so from that fight I got the skills that I wanted from Yuri Sword, and now for Estelle, I got Auto Medicine, that's really the one I wanted, but I this is actually kind of nice too, so I want to get that as well. Uh, actually, hold on. I feel like an easy win. Don't get careless. All right, and we have a leaf bat. <laughs> Level 19, resistant to wind and water, burn it alive. Holy power! This is for doing great. Burn! Destruction! Oh, flickering blade! Holy power! Destruction! Alright, who's next? <laughs> Starstruck! <laughs> I got a little hey. worked up. These are the threads that leave our future. future. And she got iron thrower, so the last thing I need is that stun magic. And that is going to so yes I did. Nope! Actually, I probably could have made that. Uh... Frick, I forgot what that one is. Um... As you know, this is easy to do this. Or does she not... Yeah, she didn't have, dang it, no, she didn't have yet. Alright. Wow, you look ugly. But before we go down there, can I cross this? Ah! Okay, so from that fight, Raven did learn a bunch of different, um skills which is nice and also I'm an idiot because the cells recover actually did work on me I just thought it would so that was my bad and I... all right no you me just wanna see what's back here dang it all right and what is I'm not gonna make it. <gasps> oh, holy hell, I made it. Not that bad. One record to show that last fight I was in, Yuri got bullied. That's dirty. Damn dirty bird. And we got a rabbit's foot. Increases luck. You know, in all my time of playing this game, I've never actually... I don't know. I've never seen the luck stat actually in action. So I don't fully know how it works in here. If anyone happens to actually know, please explain. 
And I don't think I can get it past this time. Maybe. If I could spend it get it. it. Ah! Alright, getting lucky with these rings and not lucky anymore. Alright, but thanks to that fight, Estelle did get what I need from her, so... Yeah, she got what I needed. So, we can get that off her and get something else. I would like something that gives her magic up, but... I think that's the strongest thing I have right now that does it. I'd rather her magic not go down right now, so we'll hold off on that. And now I... Go down here. There's a chest. I'll take that. No. Oh, come on! Hey, did any of you just hear a voice? I wonder where you're taking me, matey. Uh... I've heard that voice before. Patty! What? Is she a friend of yours? We've got to help her! Yeah, yeah, just leave it to me. He hit it! Nice catch! <laughs> <laughs> yeah? So you're still looking for Eifried's treasure? Eifried? Yeah, right. Treasure in a place like this? Who gave you that load of crap? The Map Making Guild! World Seller tells me all sorts of things. After all, those lads travel all around the world. Is that why you went to Rago's Mansion too? But there wasn't anything there, right? No, but a story that's 100% believable is all the more fishy. Hmm, I suppose that's true. Except that you're a hundred percent fishy. Hey, no need to be mean now. Anyway, I've got to get back to my treasure hunting. If you keep wandering around all alone, you'll get attacked by monsters again. That monster didn't attack me. We were playing together. That's what you call playing. Okay. I don't think the monster saw it that way. Hey, behind you! Okay! <laughs> I guess that means she'll be fine on her own. Little girl be packing heat. Will you come with me? I appreciate the offer, but treasure hunting will have to wait until another day. That's an awful shame, but nonetheless, I must go. Farewell! She's gone! Is she really going to be okay? She said she'll be fine, so yeah, why not? I hope you're right. Still, it's not like worrying's going to change anything. Come on, let's get going. Alright, so we learned she's not defenseless, and she's packing her old fitlock. Neat. Hey, with the skit. Lead on, old man. Man, I wish we could get out of here already. Don't get so flustered, boy. We'll get out of here nice and easy, you'll see. Not everyone leads a carefree life of unicorns and rainbows like you, you know. Life is a lot like this forest. Winding paths, intertwining. Ah, this forest is really relaxing. Come on, let's leave our philosopher behind and get a move on. Listen to what I've got to say! So you mean we're lost in the forest of life? Oh, so you get what I'm saying? 
Before we find our way out of the Forest of Life, we need to find our way out of this one. I'll lead. I have found direction in this life more times than... Hey, wait! I'm not done yet! <laughs> ah, poor Raven. But we're gonna patch real quick. And let's see if I can nab this. Alright. And I saw that in the cutscene, and it's a mimic. This one's strong! Don't just stand. They're whining. Oh, flickering blaze burn! What is the I was just getting warmed up. Curse you, mimics. And we have techno trees, which means we're getting close. Ah! Whoop, dang it. Well, that was fun. Uh, I actually don't know which way to go. I think I gotta go right. So we're gonna go straight real quick. And we got a mine bottle. And I also see another save point, which I want. Dang it. Alright, we have a rejuvenation save point. But that also means that we are at the objective. Um. Uh, uh, yeah, you know, we're just gonna keep moving. I'll get, I'll get whatever's back there later. Ooh, fancy. This is the same phenomenon we saw at Heliord. The air is weaker than it was there, but there's no mistaking it. Monster looks just like the ones that attacked Dongrast. Here it comes. Well, all right. <laughs> What's up with this? You look ugly. But let's get some details. Giga Larva, level 25, 48,000 HP, resistant to quite a few things, weak to fire, light, and dark. All right. I can't believe there's a place like this in the forest. Is there any way to quiet the monsters? We have to get them before they get us. So it's a little tough. Let's just get it over with. I hope we only have to kill this one. Stay sharp. We'll lose our lives are... if we aren't careful. Destruction! Come to me! Hey, Destroy! 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 Destroy!
think I a mission so for him, surprised. but I honestly don't remember. You can't what relax it was. yet. The air is still out of control. I feel power running all through my body. That's the logical outcome. Oh, I feel so powerful. And everybody got a little up, except the trees, Raven. the monsters. It's got to be the air that's causing this. There's more of them. Ah, so this is the end, huh? Farewell, all my dear fans, the world over. I'll make sure your gravestone reads, "Here lies the world's biggest sap." You're supposed to say stuff like, "We can make it through this together." There. You like slice through the air, but but that's impossible. What good would that knowledge do you? Well, I mean, with something like that, we might be able to stop the Blastia from going berserk. We saw that happen to a Blastia. The air was out of control. We couldn't do anything. This was only a distortion. It is a natural occurrence. Distortion? Um, thank you so much for helping us. Do not go near the air, Krenny. Huh? What do you mean, air Krenny? This place? Air Krenny are the springs from which all air in the world comes. Springs of air? Who are you? This isn't the kind of place you just go for a walk. <laughs> we would have been dead without your help, though. Thanks. That power... Could it be the Rizomata formula? I can't tell anything from checking things out here. I have to see some others. Hey, didn't that guy earlier say these were all over the world? Yeah, he did. We won't know anything solid until we find them and study them. So, I guess we're finished looking into things here? Yeah, let's get back to Dongress to meet with the Dawn. Alright. We took on the monster, got sworn, and got saved by Edgy Man McGee. And his powerful sword, apparently. <laughs> but... With that, I think we're going to go ahead and call things here, and in the next one, we will make our way to Dongress and meet with the Don, like Gary said. Until next time, Deus Ex out. Later.